community had this request for this type of event where we share insights on a very informal way between senior engineers of various companies that are active in this field in the Dutch community mainly. I have a couple of topics that I cover in the board of the DSPE which related to education and to these kind of social events and, and community events, sharing knowledge. And that's what we try to do here at the, uh, the second uh, DSP conference on precision megatronics. For me as a professional, the ESP is an organization where I meet professionals like me and we discuss the, the thing that brings us together, which is precision engineering in the broadest sense. I find this area of Holland very interesting. There's an ecosystem for precision machinery that's very unique uh, relative to almost any place in the world. For precision machines, we don't really have anything quite like what is there in Holland. And so I find coming here to be a very um, inspiring. It's the second time we, we have this conference. It's, it's a great opportunity to, uh, to, to meet your network and to discuss about your profession and about uh, the latest developments. It fits of course perfectly with, uh, with the DSP, which is about network and which is about profession and which is about industry and bringing it all together. I think the most important aspect for me are the people. Uh, the people uh, working and living in this field of high precision and high technology. Um, and I think uh, meeting these people and exchanging the ideas is for me the most relevant. We're quite flexible in, in what we do as long as we think that our members profit from the initiative. I think that fits nicely with the idea of evolution and revolution. So, so you need to continue doing what you're doing and improve that, but on the other hand also do revolutionary, quote, quote, um, new stuff. When I see those kind of events like today, it's uh, great. It's great that the community comes together, speaks together, have fun together and share knowledge. That's really needed for our uh, uh, discipline. And therefore, I would say 